the eight obvious signs that your cow is on heat. These are the signs that will tell you if your cow needs to be served or not. To many, may, they may seem as basic, they may seem as obvious, but we've come to realize that most farmers are unaware when their cow is on heat and therefore they don't know what the right time to serve. So check out and you'll tell me the difference. The first obvious sign is that that animal is usually very alert and less stressed. You will see from even the ears, uh, super alert. It is also very, very alert to changes in the environment. If there is a new person around the cow barn, you will see its behavior. You also identify it a lot of movement within the cow barn. So this animal does not rest. And this behavior is easily identified very early in the morning. Before we continue with the other seven, I would love to invite you to subscribe to our YouTube channel, FarmWorks Kenya, and ensure that you hit that notification button so that you can be notified when we post new content. Also ensure to like our Instagram page at FarmWorks Kenya, like also our, farm, our Facebook page at FarmWorks Kenya, follow us at Twitter, at Farmworks Kenya and also visit our website farmworks.co.ke. The second obvious sign is a cut on milk production and this is obvious in the morning milking. So unless there is no change in diet in the previous night, the cow should not cut milk. So you'll observe this cow, if it's on heat in the morning, there is usually a cut on milk production. The cut may be with two, three, or even four liters. And even to ask cases, the cow may disturb while milking. You'll find a cow which is very, very cool during milking. That point is usually very restless, very disturbing. It may even pour the milking bucket. And in most cases, we've seen that uh, these cows uh, in the morning milking, you'll find that the farmer usually struggles to milk them. So in, chances are that uh, this animal is at the first stage of heat. So as a farmer, you should observe from there. The third obvious sign is reduced feed intake. Most cows, when they are on heat, they tend not to feed a lot. And this one is a very, very common in most cows. And like I've said in the previous sign, the best moment to observe it is in the morning. You will see maybe the usual behavior is once you feed this animal, they all come, rush and eat. And maybe by 10 or 12, the cow has finished its food. But on this case, you will find that at the feed are as the same you left them in the morning. So this is another indication unless this animal is sick or there is other underlying condition but if all other factors are constant the animal is okay the animal is not, is not sick the reduced feed intake may be a sign of a cow which is on heat the fourth obvious sign and which is very very common and most farmers i know they are aware of this is excessive or continuous mowing most cows may tend to moo excessively when they are on heat, number two, when they are hungry, and then also number three, when they are thirsty, or maybe sometimes when they are in pain. But this excessive one, when the cow is, has enough feed, has enough water, is a sign of heat. The fifth sign, and which is most commonly the first sign that you may see, you may see the cow that is on heat, trying to sniff the vulva of other cows. The cow that is on heat, once sniffed on, may tend to lie its tail or may tend to move. This is usually followed by the next sign which I'm going to discuss, which is mounting on other animals. The sixth obvious sign is mounting on other, all being mounted on. And here I know most farmers usually confuse. This is usually what happens. At the first stages, when the cow is on heat, others usually tend to mount on it. But when they mount on it, the cow moves. It doesn't stand. 
However, as the heat progresses, when others now mount on it, it stands. And this is what we usually call the standing heat. And it is the best time to serve your cow. In these two cows, the one that is on heat is the one that is being mounted on and is not moving. Not the one that is mounting over. Okay, so farmers don't confuse uh, this one. The seventh sign is the swelling and leadness of the vulva. Cows which are uh, usually on heat, they may have some swelling and leadness of the vulva. Farmers, we usually advise you to ensure that you check out if uh, the vulva is swollen or has some reddishness, especially when you are not sure when the heat started or when you may think that uh, the heat is over. Kindly check it out. The last obvious sign is a clear discharge from uh, the vulva. This one may be seen on sticking on the legs of the cow or uh, oozing out from the vulva or even on the floor of the cow barn. Now, this discharge should be as clear as water. If it is white or cloudy, we usually recommend a farmers not to serve that cow. Instead, they should do some uh, irrigation or seek a veterinary advice. But kindly farmers, don't serve your cow when it has uh, this white discharge. In most cases, chances are that this cow won't uh, conceive. So ensure that if the discharge is not clear, as water, don't serve. But I know some farmers who shall tell their vets, you just serve and you shall have faith. And it ends up not conceiving. So ensure that you don't serve your cow when it has white discharge. Now, all these signs, it is a combination. And they may not be present in some cows, which usually have silent heat. In that case, you may decide to use maybe a hormone or try to use uh, some supplementation to improve the heat signs. Kindly share with us how you usually identify that your cow is on him.